Hey everyone, my name is Brian Moretti, and welcome to my video tour of the Century 3 Mall in West Mifflin, PA. The mall opened in 1979 and housed over 200 stores and 5 anchors at its peak. It now sits at only around 40 stores and is only anchored by a JCPenney and Dick's Sporting Goods. So what started making me think is that just today JCPenney announced that they were closing 140 stores and that immediately made me think about the JCPenney here at Century 3 Mall. So if this thing closes, I bet the whole mall will close because a majority of the stores are actually jam-packed in the JCPenney wing. It's, in this store, this mall is really depressing. The whole entire area is depressing. West Mifflin is a ghetto area. It's the whole area around it. It just it can't support this huge of a mall. It started declining in uh, the early 2000s, and as you can see, it's it, this this used to pre this used to be the premier shopping mall in West PA. People are coming from all over. This was a huge mall. Uh, it has it's mostly two levels, but it has a three level section, which as you see in a bit. Um, it, the third level is actually closed off, which I actually managed to uh, sneak up there. And as you can see, f all throughout this video, you'll see barely anybody except a few families and mall walkers and some people on their own. And which is crazy that I record this not at 9 o'clock on a Wednesday night, 7 o'clock on a Saturday night. You think sa 7 o'clock on a Saturday night, that's, you know, you go to your popular shopping shopping mall and it's packed. And there's all these people there, but it's here at Century 3 Mall. It's it's absolutely dead. So I'll stop talking for now. I'll let you guys uh, listen to some music. I'll try to take some music out from here and there so you can hear the natural ambience of the mall. It was very quiet. All you could really hear all throughout this mall was the water fountain. So uh, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and hope you guys enjoy. So I'm going to chime back in here. I'm going to talk about the anchor stores, uh, the former anchor stores, actually. And these, the closure of these anchor stores was pretty much the final blow to this mall. As you can see, three uh, major uh, anchor, er, three mo major anchors uh, closed in the past uh, about seven years, past decade, and that's kind of what just totally killed this mall. So the re most recent uh, anchor to store to close was Macy's, which closed in 2016. Then back in um, 2014, Sears closed their anchor store, and then uh, January 2009, Macy's closed their furniture gallery and clearance center, and the wing that uh, that anchor was in, and actually you just saw that right there, is actually walled off, so a whole wing of the mall is totally abandoned, so that's pretty crazy. <laughs> 